Hey guys, Megan Jeffrell for Art Panda TV, and for today's video, I'll show you two of my favorite things, and that's to paint. So I'll show you step by step how I did this watercolor painting of um, Lady Gaga and Ariana Grande. Also, I just received the package from Ramen Nagi today, and we will eat. So it's the ramen to go. Ramen to go. It's the black king. So this is my favorite uh, flavor. So stay tuned. Again, I'm Jeffrell, and um, but for Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube, I am Art Panda TV. So if you have not subscribed, please subscribe and hit that notification bell for my future videos. By the way, I'm an artist. I love watercolor painting, digital art, calligraphy. I also love playing games, PC or consoles, and also love traveling as well as food trips. So without further ado, let's go ahead and start this painting and let's eat. Ayan, so we we'll start from the background. Uh, I actually just bought this new Hick brush from Duvier. So, nung open yung SM North Edge, sa punta ko dun. So, I can try this brush. I haven't tried it. So, if, if you notice, I have been lifting some colors. So, when you say lifting, um, you use water and the brush or the wet brush to remove some paints. So, it could create a different effect. So, ayan, yun siya. Parang may hinugasan siya or parang may inilis ka na color dun sa background. So, starting with the um, nose for the portrait, yan sa Lady Gaga, I started using um, a smaller brush, a round brush, to put the, uh, the shadows on the specific um, painting. I don't want to go very detailed and I just want to be as, uh, as expressive as I can using um, the style that I know. So, yeah. And so moving along, um, now painting Ariana Grande's face. Ayan, so I tried to put some purple kasi gusto ko sana dito sa painting na to magkaroon ng contrast or magkaroon two colors which is the pink and the purple for Ariana. So if you have watched the music video, di ba, meron silang um, different uh, colors. So si Lady Gaga yung pink and si Ariana Grande yung purple. So in this painting, I want to um, use that as my concept to um, have different colors for these two faces. And so if you notice, I go again um, from light to dark, so I can always control it. Kasi kapag nag-start ka na talaga sa darkest, ang hirap na eh. It would really look not transparent. So um, this artwork, I would like it to be transparent and like um, splash of water or splash of liquid dito sa painting na to. Kasi nga diba, rain on me. So I like to uh, use the style to show watercolor effects on this painting. So if you notice, um, I just use pink or what I have is the Quinacridone pink. Ayan. So that's the Rembrandt watercolor. And then I put some paints gray so to add um, darkness or to make it darker. Ayan siya. And if you want to go lighter, just put more water. Yun lang naman yun. To make it more transparent, add just uh, more water to your um, paint or the pigment. But if you want to go darker, um, kung yun yung limit ng color mo or ng pigment mo, you can add um, paints gray so you can have or you can use it for shadows or the darkest parts of the face or areas that you want to paint. Ayan, so we we'll try to zoom ng onte so we can go through some of the details. Like what I told you earlier, I don't want to be really detailed, but uh, in some part of the face, I'd like to um, use 
the um, detailer brush especially dito meron silang sticker sa eyes eh. so ito yun eh so I used the um, uh, detailer brush that I have and uh, actually the sweeter brush and then itong round brush to add some more um, color and um, shades and shadows ayan so defining the the cheek and uh, some parts of the nose actually dito sa painting na to medyo na parami yung paint ko sa nose but it's just fine because I want I like to be more expressive on this painting Ayan, so doon yung favorite part ko yung lips. Um, because, uh, ayan, let's go to Ariana Grande's face. So, if you notice, I start from the side and the nose. And so, for you to define the um, lightest, mid, and darkest, and I always say this, try to um, paint the darkest one or um, imagine nyo na kung ano yung magiging isura niya bago nyo pa siya i-paint. So, bago mo isaw sa yung, yung brush mo dun sa paint mo, alam mo na kung anong kulay yung gagamitin mo. Hindi pwede mag-experiment ka. Ah, okay. Kasi, syempre, gaya nito, dalawa yung face. Eh, kung pangit yung kinalabasan sa kabilang face, sayang naman yung artwork. That is the use of um, trial and error mo. Now, you can do that sa scratch paper or extra paper that you have. So, on this one, I'm now going to the lips. Ito, iniwan ko yung paint. <laughs> so, nangyari dito is nagkaroon siya ng parang, um, ayan, nakita nyo sa gilid, nagkaroon ng parang um, ink doon. But we can work on that. We can still um, lift that. But now, going to the eyes and some details on the eyebrows. Using the detailer brush from Isabay. It's a travel mop brush. It's a small travel brush. Ayan. So, going to the lips. Ayan. So, this is very simple painting. Hindi masyadong detailed. Ayan, I'm now adding the purple hair or purple uh, paint sa hair ni Ariana because I want to define um, two colors here, the pink for Lady Gaga and purple for Ariana Grande. So, um, again, uh, light to dark na naman tayo dun dun sa hair. So, yan yung um, ina-upload ko dito technique. And then, Yan tayo sa mga um, thin um, hair or the strands. So actually, I don't want to be really detailed sa hair ito kasi maliit lang yung artwork. So this one, ako gusto gusto ko ito ang ginagawa. Nagdodrop ako ng paint and then I let it dry. So it actually creates an effect dun sa paper. Especially if maganda yung paper mo. Now I'm doing the thin or the strands of the hair. I am using the travel brush or the um, paper brush. So, one technique lang naman dyan, guys, even if you have a, um, uh, like a thick brush, make sure you practice using the tip of the brush para ma-practice ma ano kayo, masanay kayo na malilitis yung um, magagawa nyo yung paint. Now, going to the hair of Lady Gaga, so I actually added some red on the Crenacridone pink hair para mas tumingkad yung kulay niya. And then, mas mabas talaga yung um, pink. So, dito, hindi rin ako masyadong detailed. I just wanted to um, create an illusion for wet um, hair. Ayan. So, now, pulling the details. Yung um, buhok. <laughs> yung maninipis na buhok na nasa face niya. Yun kasi yung nasa reference photo. Um, it's like, naligo sila or kakashower lang. Yun yung nangyari dito. Or nabasa sila. Ayan. So, um, going here on the shoulders, I'll do the same thing trying to use the tip of the brush para manipis yung kakalabasan and then here going back to the hair or the uh, putting some dark hair parts on the hair of Lady Gaga so hindi rin ako masyadong naging detail masyadong dyan but I will put some um, darker tones and now dun sa pagitan ng hair nila I would like to put or to add um the collision or the combination of the color and so that's it for this painting guys i hope i have shared things to you mga techniques and yung mga style na ginagawa ko it's always been the fun sharing uh, my thoughts and my um techniques so tara na tayo na kumain so i'm hungry na kainin natin yung ramen <laughs> ayan
So, ito siya guys. So, I actually, um, I actually ordered this online. Akala ko hindi pa siya darating. Pero dumating na siya agad. So, actually, mga 20 minutes. So, yun. So, ito yung ramen to go. Because I miss, um, eating ramen sa ramen lagi. It's one of my favorite ramen shops. Okay, so may dalawang chopsticks and then ito yung ito yung ramen so yung chopsticks yung laman nga ah okay so ito yung ink ah yung ink yung yung sarap oh my god then yung garlic this ah pepper so, ito yung meat. Ay, frozen na ito. And then, um, radish ba ito? Or radish? Then, ito yung the soup. Alam po yung soup. Soup. And, ito yung noodles. Ayan, so here's how to prepare na sa gilid siya ng sticker. So, soup, and then ramen, and then yung toppings. So, if you have egg, you can actually boil egg, and then assemble. So, that's it. Gusto niya mag-snap ano, ng photo and share on um, Instagram. Alright. Yeah. Tapos na ang ating um, ramen nagi to go. So, ayan siya. Ta -da! Ta -da! <laughs> Done! Hi, ramen nagi to go. Ayan. Good job ako dyan. <laughs> ayan. So, I'm done preparing and eating the um, ramen to go. So, in order ko yung uh, black king. Yun yung favorite ko kasi. I can say it's um, the same exact taste that I ate some restaurants and for the price it's 900 it's actually good for two so it's worth it you can actually share it with your um, friends or family members then um, yun, uh, it's also good to try to be a ramen chef at home so it's a good experience that you try preparing it so I can say it's a yes for ramen nagi to go. So try it. That's it for today guys. I hope you like this video and if you do please like and subscribe. You can also browse through my other videos for my travels, art painting or time lapses. And see you on my next vlog. Bye!